welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Morg. I love all things fashion, beauty, and luxury. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. And don't forget to hit the bell notification so you won't miss out on the upload, period. Okay, baddie. So as you can see by the title, we're doing a luxury unboxing. We're doing an Hermes unboxing. These are my first ever pieces ever from Hermes. So if you want to get into it, then keep on watching. First, I just want to say, guys, my eyes are watering so bad, but I want to get this video out. So if my makeup looks a little crazy, not too much. Because my eyes are watering. I try to fix it over and over, but we just going we're just gonna do it like okay so a few weeks ago i bought my first ever pieces from hermes on rodeo drive in beverly hills this is my valentine's day gift to myself i did do a little unboxing on both my tiktok and my instagram so if you guys want to check that out it's at morgan leamber on both i'll leave that on the screen but let's get into the pieces i got two items so this is an unboxing, but like I said, I already did an unboxing on my TikTok and Instagram, so yeah. So this is the first item and it was wrapped up in the typical Hermes brown, you know, ribbon. About to get into this, but first let's get into the receipt. This is the little receipt booklet from Hermes. This is from the boutique on Rodeo Drive in Beverly Hills. Chad was my SA um, and I spent $1,445.40. Each item was $660, and then I spent $125 on tax. So let's see what items I got. The first item, it is an Hermes Click H bracelet. These used to be called the Click Clack bracelets. Some people still call those call them that. But I got my first ever piece. It's so funny because I remember being in like junior high and I um or junior high or like senior year and me and my friends was like oh we're gonna go to king of pressure today king of pressure is a huge luxury mall in pennsylvania and as soon as we like said that i was like yeah i'm gonna go to hermes and i had my heart set on either this click h bracelet or i wanted the white one at the time like really bad or the belt the hermes belt because that was like super popular um and trended at that time and that was in like 2014 2015 so Hermes is like really I know the Oran or Rom sandals are like making like they're like the trendy thing now but like the click H braces and the belts were like literally so T in like 2015 or whatever so but yeah once we got to the mall it was around like 5 30 and we went to America oops, we went to American Apparel and the mall closes around nine but Hermes it's like the most luxury store in there other than Cartier. And I think Hermes and Cartier closed at six. So by the time we got down there, they were closing and I just never ever purchased. Like I never got the piece that day, but I never ever like went back into the store and purchased it. I've definitely been in the Hermes store before after that. But anyway, we finally got our Hermes pieces. First of many, we're gonna have the Birkins, the Kellys, but let's start here. So I got the Click H bracelet in New York. This is the pouch that it comes in. And then this is the bracelet. So New York is just their black color. I am so obsessed. I got the GM size. So this comes in two different sizes, PM and GM. I'm not sure of the actual dimensions. I think it may be around 19 inches, but um, yeah, I got GM. So basically to open the bracelet, you have to pinch it or like push it together and then you twist the H. I'll show you guys again, you pinch twist open and then this is what it looks like on me and then to close it you basically do the same thing kind of push it and then twist it on so this is what it looks like on me it fits very snug and i really like that i have louis vuitton braces that i showed you guys and they kind of fall over so i like how it's snug i just feel like i'm missing some cartier like if i had a cartier love bracelet or a justin claw this would just look so tea but i'm just so happy that i finally have it um, I definitely want more colors. I think it's just so like minimal, but like also like a staple piece at the same time. And I'm really happy I got the black because I feel like it'll go with so much. So yeah, and this is just the yellow gold because I think they come in rose gold as well. Second item is a pair of shoes. I'm pretty sure you guys can already tell by the title. And I got my first ever pair of Oran. When I was at the store, he said Oran. Some people say Oran, I'ma say probably both, but. These are the Orlan sandals. This is the ribbon that the box came in. And then they come with dust bags. You get a dust bag for each sandal, per sandal. And I got the Hermes Orlan sandals in the New York color, which is, again, black. So I got the black. 
Hermes sandals. Yeah. So T, and then they just have some cushion in them. Um, I got these in a size 41. When I went there, I was like, I'm pretty sure I'm like a 39 and a half or 40. Um, I definitely am a 39, which is just like a nine in women's in most shoes. But I was like, when Chad was helping me, I was like, I think I'm gonna be a 39 and a half or a 40. We tried the 39 and a half, we tried the 40, we tried the 40 and a half. And the 41 is actually what I had to end up going with. You wanna get a size that good enough for your foot to be able to go in but you don't also want them to be too big because again this is leather and they're going to eventually give and stretch so my feet are like i wouldn't say they're like right at the back but they are they're not hanging off but they're like they like fit perfectly because i start to wear them and the leather is not as stiff then they're going to give and my foot is going to be able to slide up a little bit more so these are a 41 so technically in the u.s size these are like a size 11 and i wear a size nine and women so as far as sizing i may say you have to go up between at least a half size to a full size to a full two sizes depending on how your foot is i believe a a, a big reason i had to go up two full sizes is because i also have wide feet my feet are not like super big i mean nine is some people say that's given la cienega but um I have wide feet as well so you want to be able to have like comfort with the shoe so you want to be able to get a size that's not only like good in length but making sure that your foot is comfortable and not busting out the size as well so this is the Hermes or Rand sandals they you know just have the logo here and then they says say Hermes on the back and they say size 41 and this is what they look like with the bracelet next to them i told myself like so many times i had like the money for the bracelet or the money for the sandals and i was like no we're not we're not getting this until we can get the set like isn't this just so team together and then i have like little louis vuitton earrings i just think this is just so cute like i'm obsessed so freaking cute Hermes or Rand sandals were $6.60 as well. I plan to wear these a lot, like more on so on an everyday basis. I know a lot of people wearing them for like vacation in the summer. I live in Los Angeles, California, so I plan to wear these. Actually, it's pretty cold right now, but I plan to wear these like on a daily basis, running errands, just, you know, with simple outfits, everyday outfits. I think they are going to be very comfortable once they give. They're not uncomfortable now, but you can just tell they're very stiff shoes, not like even bending or at all. So I'm very excited to wear these. So far, I have not worn the bracelet, but that is not a bracelet that slides on me. And I'll try it on for you guys one more time. You can see. Um, and I just like how easy it is. Like my Louis Vuitton bracelets are a little bit harder to get on. So hey guys, that pretty much wraps up the video. I know it's really quick. I don't have much to say because I literally just got these items two weeks ago and I didn't really unbox them. They sat in my closet until yesterday because yesterday was Valentine's Day. And I wanted to do like a Valentine's Day unboxing for myself because this was my gift from me to me. Treat yourself, spoil yourself, drop the bag. If nobody else gonna do it, do it for yourself. Give yourself the world. This is what my whole Valentine's Day was about. That pretty much wraps up the video. I'm so excited to finally have some Hermes in my collection. I can't wait to get some more pieces. I definitely think I'm gonna get another pair of Rand sandals in gold and then the uh, Click H bracelet. And I think it's called Macaroon E Grease or something like that. It's like a taupey color. That's next on my wish list. And then I want the white pair as well because I just think they're really cute, um, fun, staple pieces to have. I do want to start getting more into like Cartier to have like the real gold jewelry and not just fashion pieces. But again, I'm so, so happy to have these Hermes pieces in my collection. And let me know what else you guys want to see. As always, Converse is about. Uh, see you in the next one.